Seldom in history can so many men of great courage have gathered together in one place as today, when 300 holders of the Victoria Cross meet to mark the centenary of that most honored of all medals. Men from all over the Commonwealth, men with famous names like Lieutenant General Carton de Wyatt, and men from ordinary homes, parading before Queen Elizabeth in Hyde Park, where a century ago the first VCs of all paraded before Queen Victoria. Commanding the VCs is Lieutenant General Lord Freiburg, who won his Victoria Cross in France in 1916. Over 1,300 men have won the medal since it was first cast, and nearly a quarter of them are here for the Queen's inspection. Hundreds more who will never parade again are here in spirit, their medals worn by widows, children or grandchildren. 31 VCs attend the parade in wheelchairs, and for each of these the Queen and the Duke have a special word while the leaders of the country look on. What have they in common, these men of valour, apart from their heroism? Modesty, certainly. Before the parade, our cameraman tried to find a man with two VCs, but he was hiding on the edge of the crowd, his medals in his pocket. They're all like the man next door, and they're great because they have proved that in ordinary men, there is the stuff of greatness.